Greetings, in this video I want to show you how to fix the continuous reboot loop issue that you may be getting after installing a new app and usually that's what happens. You install a new app and you keep getting this issue. So I want to show you how to troubleshoot with that. Usually, again, it happens after you install a new app. So what you want to do is you want to hold down while it's on, you want to hold down the power button and the back button at the same time. It usually takes for 30 seconds. And then when you see this off button, continue to hold down both buttons. Don't release and don't hit the power. You keep doing this until you see the Samsung home screen. Okay, you see there it says rebooting and you can let go. Now it gives you, if it gives you an option to update, go ahead and choose update. Now if you got it connected, if it's connected to Bluetooth to your phone, what you're going to have to do is go into your watch app and then you will have to clear the data and I'll show you how to do that now. So under the app what you're going to do is scroll down and then click watch settings. And then what you're going to do from here is click on memory, just tap memory. And then just choose clean now and that should clean out all the data and the, the catch. Okay, once the reboot is finished you're going to have to go back and uninstall the app that you, you had just installed. And then you may need to reinstall it. And that, would, uh, that should fix the issue that you have. Now if you tried all of that, the only next issue to do is to do a hard reset. It's basically a factory restore. And remember, this is a full factory restore, so it will wipe out you know, all your apps and stuff like that. So make sure that you have everything backed up. So you want to first power it down and these two buttons here on the right, this is the power home button here, and this is the back button. So what we're going to do is hold it down until you get to the off. Power it off, shut it down completely. Now you got to be really quick here because it'll go quick. Um, so sometimes you might have to try it three or four times before you get to the recovery menu. So we're looking for the recovery menu. So what you're going to do is you're going to hold down the home button. And when you see the Samsung logo, continue to hold down the home button until you see a little blue rebooting. And then that's going to take you to the menu. Okay, keep holding down until you see rebooting. Keep holding. There you go. Now hit it once. Okay, so you can see here on my active menu you're going to go to recovery and I'm, I keep pressing down so it won't turn off. When you get to recovery, you're going to hold it down. And when you hold it down, that's going to take you to recovery. If you decided to change your mind, see it automatically reset because I didn't hold it down. If you decide you don't want to recover, just go down to the um, power off. Okay, thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe.